what's going on guys it's Ben from Parker Baits and welcome back to another fishing video today you join me down the famous linear fisheries with my good friend Rob and also one of the Parker Baits ambassadors now this is going to be a very quick video guys I'm only here for not even 24 hours I've got to leave what's the time now I don't even know half 12 half 12 ish now and I'm off tomorrow about nine o'clock so that puts into perspective how much time I've actually got on this session Rod's already out I'm just fishing two I've doubled up with Rob I'm fishing two rods each nice bit of social and um, why don't we have a little touch on in a second and um, I'll, I'll speak to Rob we'll turn the camera around he can speak to you guys and tell you exactly <laughs> what happened last night mate carnage wasn't it got here about two o'clock yesterday evening yeah and Lewis another one of the pack of bits ambassadors was into the peg to the right of me turned up he had a nice mid 20 and then had a nice 35 pounder as well and then after that, then helping him get pictures, managed to get my rods out for the night. And then about half six this morning, I managed my first fish, which was 27 pound five, I think. And then I had another three then after that. <laughs> I know. Three. Animal. Um, I think they were 22, a 25 and a 30 pound two ounce as well. So that's my first 30 for the year as well. Good man, well done mate. So yeah. Smashed it. But then it's been pretty quiet since, to be fair, so. Pop-ups, fruit and nut pop-ups, yes, or the pineapple, fruit and, did you fruit say? And nut. So I had one on the orange pineapple pop-ups, yeah. and one on the pinks, and two on the whites. Happy days. Nuts. So, yeah, just pretty much got one of each out now tonight. Well, well in, mate, and hopefully yeah. we can keep this going now over the duration. Tonight. You're here till Sunday, though, aren't you, as well? Yeah, Sunday. I can stay till Monday, but... Yeah, nice. Nice. Fish. Fingers crossed. Fish. Right, so there it is. That's who I'm with, guys. That's where I'm at, and that's how long I am here for. I'm going to bring you on my journey, and just very quickly, my name's Ben, and this is the Parker Parker Bates Parker Brothers YouTube channel, and we upload every Sunday 7:30, and we've also started uploading on Wednesday 7:30 as well. So, like I said, if you are free on a Sunday 7:30, join in the Parker Bates wave. There's loads of like-minded people in there, and it's a, it's, a, it's a good it's a good laugh on a Sunday, and also nice to watch the video together. So there it is. Without further ado. I'm going to crack on give us a thumbs up make sure you comment down below smash that subscribe button so you don't miss any videos going forward and hopefully myself and rob up linear on b1 can bring you an absolute banger come on the car what you got there mate tuna sandwich tuna sandwich like a tuna crunch tuna crunch yeah <laughs> Rob enjoy that stinky sandwich he's got going on in there. Look at him, the cretin. <laughs> got a bit of blooming lettuce hanging out of his mouth like a blooming tortoise or something. <laughs> <laughs> so Rod's. Rod's Rob's are in the opening of the gap, 25 wraps. That's where he had the fish last night. Mine. At the end of the tree line, right at the end, I've got two rods absolutely on the money end of here. 24 wraps, a little bit back from the other one. So here and here. So we're going to do Rob's one side. <laughs> ben nearly breaks his neck. <laughs> oh no. I can't even swallow my food. <laughs> so yeah, that's a fan of attack without breaking my neck. <laughs> come on the carp. Well the heavens have opened and I've just topped up with a few spoms on the money and uh, the gentleman next door is spomming as well at the moment but yeah the wind's kicked it's actually coming sort of our way now Rob isn't it? Yeah that's nice. Where was it going yesterday? It Down was there? kind of to the right yesterday. Yeah, so going. Left. yeah mad. Absolutely ramoed the whole lake's ramoed so yeah it's going to be interesting to see what the night brings. What's just happened there then? Oh, well, um, <laughs> well, <laughs> we had a little cheeky bet on, to, on two horses. Yeah. Um, basically, I'm in the tipster for Cheltenham, and we put, put a single bet on it and a double, and they both just come in. So, <laughs> what did we do? Two seconds. We got given this over. <laughs> so, I'm guessing the and Ben are having pizza tonight. <laughs> And possibly dessert. Oh, cookies. Cookies as well, mind. Oh, <laughs> oh, don't, mate. I'm trying to be good, but yeah, fair play. And uh, nice one, mate. Cheers for the heads up. <laughs> I can't even load it. So the other one's just come in. Oh, no. And that number. <laughs> it's just jumped to 155. That's three. So I'm now at 200 now. <laughs> oh. Fair play. <laughs> Garibaldi time. Mmm. 
which is Aaron, South Coast Angler. Lovely jubbly. Rig prep done for tonight. Um, the right hand one's a pineapple pop up cut right down, and this is a fruit and nut cut right down with some fancies on the end. Lovely. <laughs> Money. Good fishing, that. <laughs> well, that's it, all the rods are well and truly sitting there now and we ain't gonna move them till the fish come, but look at it, it looks beautiful out there, doesn't it? Doesn't it look nice? The wind's turned, it's coming in towards us and we really couldn't ask so much more, to be honest with you. I hope it pulls the fish down tonight and we start having it off. It would be, it would be lovely if we could have a little red letter. Um, on a, especially on a quick overnight for myself and obviously Rob to then continue it and follow through and keep going but yeah come on the beast of Bray's nose I'm not asking for much what do you want mate? I'll take a 40 pounder take a 40 pounder I'll be happy with that the pea fish the pea fish I'd like to have that again yeah, <laughs> yeah you know <laughs> look how serious you are so he's put another one on and um, if this comes in how much? 550 and he's already won a couple of hundred the, the, the nut job. Fair play. Look, look, my mate's in me now. Look, yeah. Oh, Dan. No, I know. <laughs> I just got 550 quid off that. <laughs> Brilliant. <laughs> Well, there you go. It's all happening here up in here, and fair play to him. Nice moment, that. But like I said, Rod's out on a serious note, and um, it really is looking good for tonight, guys. It really, really is. And like I said, hopefully I can bring our journey. We do a bit of a night shift tonight, but what a way to start this evening. Happy blooming days, baby. Come on, the Parker Bakes. Coming up to just gone six, is it? It's absolutely flat calm out there, it's completely changed, there's a whole lake. But Rob was saying this is what happened last night, wasn't it? Yeah, it happened last night about half five, which tonight's a little bit later, well, it was an hour later, but yeah, it went flat calm last night and then that's when it started going off really, so fingers crossed, Think. nine o'clock seems to be bite time. Just so, after nine, around nine yeah, you said, didn't nine. you? So yeah. yeah. Fingers crossed, mate. Fingers crossed. Right then, I'm just going to go through Rob's mix. What he's just caught, um, knocked up. He's not putting this out now. He's putting it out this evening. So if you could just quickly, what, what you're doing then, mate? And this is what you were fishing last night when you had the fish, wasn't it? Yeah. So, in the morning or whatever. Yeah, this is what I've been fishing since we got here. So we have got a base mix of um, hemp and maize, uh, hemp and sweet corn, sorry. Yeah. And then you've got the fruit and nut chops, the OG fish chops. And then we've also got some fruit and nut 10 mils in there as well. Nothing massive, just trying to keep it small and keep them in the area for as long as we can, really. It's been doing the do, mate, and it? yeah, it's so certainly been working. Managed so. for early hours this morning in the space of an hour, so. Yeah, fair play, mate, fair yeah. play. Well, fingers crossed that happens tonight. And then he can top up with that lovely mix, and that is what he's put out on his rods in between that gap in the tree like I mentioned earlier so come on the carp well on cue Rob's in <laughs> I had a liner on my um, left hand rod and now uh, Rob's, Rob's rod's tanked off and he's in so I'll come back to you soon what rod was that on mate? what, what bait? Um, I've got two it's over them uh, a normal pink pop up um, up with live maggots on, yeah, or them rubber things that you've given me earlier. 
Nice. I'm not going to know until I get it in, but... Happy days. Well in though, mate. Coming in quite easy, is it? Or? Yeah, it's swimming towards me. Nice. Well, I wasn't expecting that, mate. Yeah. First tench I've ever seen come out of here. It's a nice one, though. It's a good tench. Boom, good tench. Yeah, yeah fair, fair play, mate. Biggest I've ever had, a PB tench. <laughs> PB tench, yeah, there you go. Yeah. Oh, oh wrong way, mate. Yeah. <laughs> mate, that's mad, isn't it? Yeah. Fair play, mate. Well in, though. <laughs> Money? Happy? Happy days, oh happy days, oh happy. That's it mate, it's on the money, you're going to catch another Timmy the Tench now. Oh fuck, I'm going to have to bring it a bit like this. Jack in? Yeah, fucking right. If I'm not comfortable, mate. What, was that on the right hand side of it? Was that was that casted to the right? Was it? Yeah, nice, nice. All right, I'll let Rob get them out without breaking my neck like earlier. That's mad though. After you had a liner. That is mad. Yeah, literally. So I had a liner, left hand rod, and then within about another minute, the rod went. So. It's gone eight o'clock next door, got a little fire going and uh, it's looking good out there. It's looking good, wind's still trickling in towards us. Pitch black at the moment, but nine o'clock, just after nine is when it's been magically happening. Food's been ordered. I'll show you that when it arrives. <laughs> How much we spend? Oh. <laughs> um. £48, Got to treat ourselves with our wins, mate. Oh. How much did you win in the end, at all in all? £640 profit. Brilliant. I'm going to come, yeah. up, I'm gonna come out with about 300 myself, so thanks very much, mate. No <laughs> <laughs> Dinner time soon. Lovely jubbly. Wow, food's turned up. What's the state of this? So we've got cookies. Yeah, and two of each. And then we got, what's this one then mate? That would be mine. It's got mussels on it. Prawns, looks like cockles maybe. Squid. Black olives. Lovely jubbly. I know people watching this are going to go, oh my god, what is he eating? Stuffed crust, yeah, hot dog stuffed crust. And then, look at that mate. So you want to try some seafood? Mm, mm. <laughs> nah. Nah. <laughs> yeah, mate. Oh, thank you. <laughs> and then these as well. What did you get? Oh, the hanky panky chocolate pies <laughs> for pudding. So this, um, I know we're going to get asked this. So this takeaway is called American Pizza. The American Pizza, isn't it? Yeah. And do not ring them up because that was an absolute nightmare. It took 12 minutes to order. And that was the bloke, um, anyway, yeah. yeah, so just, yeah. So on that note, use the app. They got an app system and then just maybe put in the comments or something, um, ring me when you're 10 minutes away. But anyway, we're gonna shut up, enjoy our food. Yes. Lovely jubbly. Can we just take a minute, people? <laughs> that is naughty, isn't it? Absolutely naughty. It does look good. It does look good. It just falls apart on your fingers. Oh no, it's going everywhere. She don't approve of the cookies. It just breaks, look at it. Tastes good though. Good, that's the main thing. It's like play dough. Smashing my way through this, banging. Four. Oh, pitch black. Rob's just going to top up with some bait. Yeah. Mm. I'm glad I come because we had a good, we had a good, it was nice to see Rob. We had a good social last night. We also won some bits, so I ain't going away home empty-handed if you like. 
he's giggling next to me but um yeah mad mad fishing the same as rob was the night before if not more on point i mean rob spawning spawning yesterday i mean i didn't see it the day before was on point yesterday on point it was perfect nothing um guy next door nothing guy next to that nothing from what i've heard on this bank i haven't heard nothing last no. night so the fish have obviously moved um which is a bit gutting but it just goes to show you know you can have it off one night and then the next nothing um as you've just clearly seen <laughs> but um yeah it's what it is but i've got another hour and a bit or so something like that to really get up soon Excuse me, start doing a slow pack down and then go from there. I have got one hell of a week this week coming up. It's madness, it's utter madness. Um, the Big One Show. And on that note, guys, um, if you are coming to the Big One Show um, this coming Sunday, make sure you head over to the Parker Bait stand. The bait is going to be the cheapest it's ever been, um, full stop. The only time it's been cheaper or the that was cheaper um, would have been our open day and that is only two days a year we do discounts at Parker Bates so yeah looking forward to meeting some new people for sure and I'm sure I'm bumping into a load of people that watch the video so yeah I'm going to leave it at that guys a little bit more of an update on what's happening going into next week no fishing for me I'm a little bit gutted but I am also very happy that we're going to the big one show so yeah I'm going to leave it at that and uh Let's do it. Coffee time in my carp tonic mug. I've packed down half my gear. I'm going to leave my rods out till last minute and I've got to get on the road as my missus is going to beat me up. So, yeah. Not, mate, one beep in the night. Obviously, that line of that we said, and then obviously Rob had the tench. And at that point, this was prior to nine o'clock, thinking, yeah, here we go, it's going to go off. And it just hasn't happened. That wind's kicked again now. It's been all over the place since we've been here. It's been going down this this way and then now in towards us. So it's a bit here, there and everywhere. And I, I definitely reckon that's got a say in what the fish are doing from what I know about this lake in previous sessions and stuff. So still ramo though. People in there, I think a gentleman's leaving up there now on peg seven, I think Rob said. There's Rob's fancy cradle there. But yeah, it's all looking good. Coffee time it is. Right, well guys, that is it, and that is my quick session here with Rob. Rob's actually going to stay on now, I've given him a load of bait, and he's going to be staying on till Monday. Monday, yeah. Yeah, Monday, so that'd be nice. Um, I'm going home, and I'm going to Bongo Bingo's this afternoon, so that's going to be interesting. I've not um, done that in a while, so yeah. But, uh, <laughs> I'm sure it'll be a laugh, to say the least. But not only that, before I go, guys, like I said earlier, um, when I woke up and I looked like um, deaf, um, I, I quickly mentioned about the Big One show. We are heading to the Big One show this Sunday, and um, it's our first big show. There's some going to be some exclusive off offers in the first come, first serve basis. We've got some um, products that we've that have not seen our website, and um, it's, it's, it's it's I'm going to say what it is. It's a Scopex flat spot. And I think we've got about 50 for each day. So the first 50 people that come up will have an opportunity to buy these, um, this product and have something that nobody else has got. So that's quite cool. Not only that, like I said, we're gonna have a pellet station. I'm gonna do some, maybe some rig work there on the day, bring some bits down with me. Um, not only that, we've got a load of ambassadors, Rob being one of them behind the camera now, he's gonna be there. Um, you, you may have seen him on the channel before. He's an animal, always catching 40. Well, caught, caught a 40 pounder last year, your PB mate, you're always catching yeah. 30. He's had a very good session last year. There's a, there's a couple of others on there. Theo, someone else you may have seen on the channel, he's coming down. Lee Caravan Carper, a massive YouTuber, he's also on our stand. And a massive part of Parker Bates Lee is as well. Um, so yeah, so keep that in mind if you are heading to the Big One Show guys, but that's this week's video. Also, again, just before I leave, if you haven't seen our, I don't like to keep plugging, but if you haven't um, seen our Instagram or Facebook, make sure you go over, check that out guys, because um, 
we every day what we do is we do look we do stories and on these stories we talk about what we're doing the reasons why we're doing it the, the cooking processes um, the dusting processes us packing orders us sending out orders us talking about the whole family run business business day in day out especially beginning of the week on our instagram slash facebook story so it's definitely worth if you are interested and you do want to join the park of H wave head over and uh, check that out so that's it that's this week's video guys give us a thumbs up make sure you comment down below smash that subscribe button so you don't miss any videos going forward and i'll see you all very soon peace out